Egypt. We are stopping you on every front. True patriots know your blueprint. We know your criminal operation. We're the people. We're the people. We're the cops on the ground The because the cops won't do their job, so we're doing it. And we know your crimes. We know what you do. We know your signatures, and we're watching you. And when you stage stuff, we're there watching you. You're not going to get away with it this time. Now, the one man I wanted to get on is the editor of the New American Magazine, newamerican.com, or thenewamerican.com, that for 20 years that I've been reading them has been exposing the war on the West like no one else. War on the West, why more Bundy standoffs are coming, is his latest article. They document, and we'll put it on screen, the executive order by Bill Clinton back in 1996. You can go to the William F. Jasper Presidential Library and read 12,986. Kentucky legislature looked at it and said it's a U.N. takeover of the country of the land because to get the buffer zone you've got to then sign the land around it to them they've shut down gold mines ski resorts you name it with this so that the land that the aspen institute and the nature conservancy and sierra club owns that all doubles or triples in price or if he shuts off coal in utah that doubles the chinese coal see this is the scams he did and william f jasper exposed william jefferson clinton you know it's got to be hundreds of articles so he is the expert on this and, 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 and what this form of Agenda 21 is, he's been to the conferences, he's been to the UN meetings to understand what's happening and how real this is and why you see the Republicans coming out saying, Harry Reid's not involved, the Chinese aren't involved, there's no solar farm, look, Alex is wrong, it's another part of the state. It, it's a carbon sink. If they're allowed to build that, they, they allotted the Bundy Ranch, this is in the BLM documents, as the set-aside. That's what they do. That's UN... UNESCO executive order that Bill Clinton signed us on to. I mean, I'm an expert in this, folks. This is what I do. I made a film about it in 97 based on Jasper's research. And I went and checked it at the library, at the UT library. I went to the national parks. They threatened to arrest me on video for asking about the sign politely. That's their attitude. That's how imperious they are. Now, I'm going to give you the floor, sir. I wanted to do that preface there. We're going to break in a few minutes, but... Break down just in a nutshell what we're facing and why you say we're going to see more of this Bundy situation. I know you live out in the West yourself, William F. Jasper. Yes, I grew up here in the West. <clears throat> grew up in the Pacific uh, Northwest. Uh, that's where I live now. Uh, logging, ranching, farming, mining country. These are the natural resource industries that are the bedrock of every industrialized nation. You can't have what we have as a modern industrialized nation without those basic in industries. You need energy. You need, you need to be able to feed your people with farming and ranching. You need to be able to produce all of the things for building houses and uh, construction and for all of the things that uh, we use every day that uh, we used to produce completely here in this country and which now have been offshored to other countries. But uh, for the last uh, several decades, there has been a war on the West. And as we point, have pointed out many times, the, the federal footprint in the 12 Western states is uh, gigantic. Uh, from uh, over a third to over two thirds of the land of each of the, the 12 Western states is owned and or controlled. An even larger amount of it is controlled. Uh, by the federal government. You don't have that in the Midwest and the, and the, and the Eastern states. Uh, that isn't the way that our founding fathers intended for this to be. But that's not good enough for the uh, federal bureaucrats, the one-worlders, the globalists, and their uh, environmental activist uh, phony friends. Uh, they want to take even more. And every president, Republican and Democrat, for the last several administrations, has increased millions more acres for national parks, for uh, endangered species, it, it, even uh, uh, private lands, taking more and more private lands, adding millions to the already unsustainable inventory. Every year, the, the uh, General Accounting Office uh, issues reports showing all of the delinquent uh, maintenance records for the national parks, for the BLM lands, national forest lands. They have, as typical with every government operation, they are destroying the environment, destroying our energy 
uh, independence. Stay there. And I want to tie it into the U.N. executive orders and more. And this is happening all over the planet. It's one reason so many immigrants are coming here. They're being driven off their land under UNESCO. We'll be right back with William F. Jasper, editor of the New American Magazine. I'm Alex Jones. Silver has always been nature's very own antibiotic, and only one system allows you to generate an endless supply of natural silver solutions. SilverLungs.com. You'll find no wild claims or pseudoscience, just a lifetime of nano-sized pure silver solutions. The Silver Lungs generator allows you to make your own, so stop paying for silver solutions. The unique lung delivery system targets respiratory infections where other silver solutions simply cannot reach. See the Silver Lungs generator and lung delivery system at SilverLungs.com. That's SilverLungs.com. How can you save a ton of money and prepare for emergencies? By having your own in-home freeze dryer from Harvest Right. Now you can cut down on wasted food by freeze drying your leftovers. That's right. Create your own long-term food storage by freeze drying your own fruits, meats, vegetables, even complete meals with the Harvest Right in-home freeze dryer. Imagine the savings and the peace of mind. See how the amazing Harvest Right freeze dryer works at HarvestRight.com. Great news, pure water lovers. BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com has a special discount offer for all GCN listeners. You can't do better than a Big Berkey for economy. For only 1.7 cents a gallon, a single set of filters can last for 5 to 10 years. There's none better than a Big Berkey for emergency preparedness as a backup water source. And you just can't beat a Big Berkey to remove dangerous chlorine, all types of fluoride, pathogenic bacteria, cysts, parasites, and unhealthy bodies products from municipal water. Berkey water filter systems are even powerful enough to purify stagnant pond water. For the gold standard in water filters, get a Big Berkey at BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com. And all GCN listeners get 5% off all ceramic filter systems. For details, call 1-877-99-BERKEY. That's 877-99-BERKEY. Big Berkey water filters for the love of clean water. Hi there. My name is Frank Bates. What I'm about to tell you in the next 60 seconds could get me in a lot of trouble. I just created a free video presentation at 123coverup.com that exposes the electricity monopolies and government agencies for what they really are. Incompetent, lying crooks that are counting on your ignorance and fear to keep your power bills criminally high. Some have called this a conspiracy. Others have called it a cover-up, and you will be shocked to find out how deep the conspiracy goes. My video at 123coverup.com exposes the truth and shows you the secret of how I beat them and how you can beat them too. Watch the controversial video that thousands of other smart patriots have already seen in the last three months. Go to 123coverup.com and discover one weird trick to slash your power bill and protect your home. Go watch my video now at 123coverup.com before they force me to shut it down. Again, that's 123coverup.com. I have bought a few bottles of heart and body extract and have to say that it, it certainly does work. That's what Jack from Michigan had to say after his experience with heart pain and what he did to treat it with heart and body extract. I actually had a huge heart flutter. I was also having some edema around my ankles and very worrisome clot in my uh, right leg that would happen from time to time while I was trying to sleep. Heart and body extract is all natural with no negative side effects. It will help repair or correct past problems associated with the heart and body circulation. After my second bottle of heart and body extract, all problems are now gone. Order at hbextract.com or call 866-295-5305. I ordered a third bottle of heart and body extract for maintenance as I want to keep everything working. Order heart and body extract at 866-295-5305 or hbextract.com. Heart and body extract for a long and healthy life. During the break, I was thinking, man, Alex, I wish you didn't always get so frantic on air. Then I realized, I mean, it's a UN takeover by special interest, not even to help the environment, but to steal property. And it's criminal, and I'm informed, and the public isn't, and I'm sick of it. We have a map that stopped uh, the ratification of Agenda 21 by Congress that Dr. Coleman put together. Kaufman, and we'll put that on screen. Uh, this, according to the UN maps, uh, is what 
they would end up, if you're a TV viewer, end up having as core reserves, little to no human use since about half the country. Yellow, highly regulated use. And then the green, well, you can have some use, less than 10% of the country. And this is what they do. This is how they act. William F. Jasper uh, is our guest to discuss this. And, you know, the Republican leadership, William, won't ever touch this now because they're in on it. And, well, let's continue uh, describing how it works, the names they use, the war on coal. Uh, why do they want to shut down American resources? Well, if America is strong and vibrant and prosperous, if we can produce here what we need, uh, that makes us uh, less uh, susceptible to all of the schemes which they have cooked up for uh, regulating every aspect of our lives. Uh, if we uh, have our own energy here, if we have our own minerals and, and mines and things that uh, we need to produce the, all of the things we use, uh, then we won't be dependent on China, on Mexico, on uh, Brazil, etc. Uh, that uh, militates completely against uh, what the central planners have in store for us. They want the United States to be brought low so that they, the central planners, will be able to dole out and ration everything. And here in the western states, that's why they are particularly keen on locking everything up and running off the land, the few remaining farmers, ranchers, uh, producers, independent uh, people that, uh, that uh, have uh, property and can fend for themselves. Uh, we see, as I mentioned, the, the mining industry has been under attack, and this is a three-pronged attack. You have government, all these government agencies, uh, the EPA, BLM, Forest Service, uh, et cetera, uh, Army Corps of Engineers. You have the uh, big green environmental organizations, uh, the Sierra Club, Audubon, Environmental Defense Club, uh, National Wildlife Federation, and then you have the big corporations and big foundations funding uh, them. And so this is, uh, Ron Arnold referred to this as the Iron Triangle. And, uh, you know, we have many documents from, for instance, uh, conferences where uh, uh, council attorneys uh, and leaders of the environmental groups laid out their strategy, particularly, for instance, as it relates to the Bundy uh, situation today here. Uh, go, go clear back to 1991. In uh, March 7 through March 10 of 1991, at the University of Oregon uh, in uh, law school at, at Eugene, Oregon, uh, the National Wildlife Federation held a three-day conference. And uh, one of the people who gave a major presentation there uh, was a, a man by the name of uh, Ellicher, uh, he, Roy Elliker. And Roy Elliker came right out and said in his presentation, look. Uh, cattle ranching is a tough business. These guys out there uh, who are cattle ranchers, if we saddle them with enough regulations and we keep changing things often enough, we can force them to go broke. And that's what they've been trying to do. They had a... Well, that's a, what Obama said about coal. He said, you can build a plant, we'll just raise absolutely. the tax where you go yeah. broke. And we, have a, we have similar seminars and, and symposia where they uh, laid out the same strategy for timber, uh, logging, uh, for, and you've uh, written articles exposing this truly criminal conspiracy where they say it openly. And look, beef's all time high. Everyone I know is getting out of the cattle business, including my family, because you cannot make money. Mission complete. Right. If you if you settle them with enough regulations and litigation, and and that was very clear. Uh, Roy Elliker in the National Wildlife Federation said, "Look, we'll tie them up in litigation. We'll we'll uh, drive them into bankruptcy," and that's what the plan has been and uh in in dealing with this current issue of of the bundy situation uh i've referred a lot to the wayne hage case because we've covered that extensively over the last uh three decades and it's really a model case both in exposing this strategy because it's now come out in court uh, Judge Jones uh, came out. Stay there. Tell us about that case and, and, and some of the others when we come back. I've seen cases where people own the land, but it's inside a national park or BLM and they just block the roads. 
and I know you've covered those cases. I mean, this is piratical seizure. We're being conquered by the globalists. We'll be back with William F. Jasper. We're